CATV is proudly presented by Toyota. A lot of people have been saying that since the test series at the start of a new era um, for this team, and we've lost about kind of Smith. Um, is, that, is there that sort of mood in the team? And, and do you think maybe the guys are struggling a bit to come to terms with it? Not in the T20 squad. I suppose more so in the test side where they've been an integral part for a long time. But Smith and Callis haven't played a T20 for South Africa for a couple of years, so I don't think it's too much of an issue with the T20 group of players. Um, Dan Lehman was in a moment ago saying that uh, in both formats, he felt that the Sydney team was the best team in the world. Is that correct? Yeah, look, it's... We obviously dropped a few catches that have that have hurt our chances in the test series, and um, it's difficult to, to, to judge in a seven-over game. I thought we fielded really well for those seven overs in Durban, and look, Avi's <laughs> Avi made two mistakes today, and I mean that doesn't happen often. But yeah, I suppose they have outfielded us, um, but it's, it's it's not something that we're going to lose too much sleep on because we know we've uh, we have quality field inside, and we've got some great athletes. We just got to keep working on them. Things will turn for us. Well, it is, there, so, is there still a lot of emphasis on the fielding there? Is there a lot of intense work done you know, during the progress again? No, there is. Um, first of all, after the series, I mean, okay, the one, one match you already can't take into account for that series of hours and so but Going into, into this T20 World Cup, I feel you've got more questions to answer now than what was maybe the case a week ago? Yeah, look, I suppose, um, uh, I don't think questions, but I suppose there have been some good answers for us. Um, it, 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 for starters, it shows the, the impact of not having guys like Mona and Dell playing for two, two experienced players, and um, you can't buy that type of quality and that type of experience, I suppose. So an integral side of our part, and, and, and not having them probably highlights how important they are for South African cricket. Um, but other than that, look, it's T20 cricket strange. We lost a seven-over game that that can go that way, and then um, we got outplayed today by a powerful Australian side. So I, I don't think there's a, a need to try. And for sure, we want to improve every single time and make a few changes here and there. But you can't. We've played good T20 cricket for the last year, and but there's no need to make too many drastic changes and bring in all new personnel now because the side has played well for the last year. Confidence not that badly dented as far as you're concerned, or what? Yeah, look, I suppose T20 cricket's got a lot to do with confidence. Um, on the plus side, South Africa have gone to World Cups before, um, extremely confident and, and playing extremely well, and have come unstuck, so maybe this is a good omen for us. So, just touching on that, um, you've obviously been involved in quite a few World Cups down the years, and, and there's always the same questions thrown before. I've only been involved with one. Okay, as you know, two, three, <laughs> only one, just the one. As an assistant as well. As the one, just the one. <laughs> no, 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 just the one. Do, do you sense that there's a, a slightly different feel going into this World Cup than previous times? Look, I think the. We, I'm sure the previous sides also went to World Cups wanting to win. We obviously want to win that World Cup. Every side going there wants to win it. I suppose it's. Uh, there are probably seven or eight sides that could win this World Cup. So we're one of seven or eight teams that have got a chance of winning it, and I suppose that's maybe not a bad way to go there. Um, the pressure won't probably be there as, a, as one of the only two or three teams that can win it as an outright favourite or something like that. We, we're one of a group of seven or eight, and in competitions like this, you need a couple of players to play well, you need a few things to go your way, and you, you need to win some big moments. So I suppose it's probably a little bit less pressure than I was going to this event than previous ones. Is Ashim's form a concern for you? Ashim's form, um, look, he got a I think, four innings ago. Didn't he? In P? But I mean, overall, over the, you know, you, you know, usually know yourselves that Ashim is not that kind of we know over the last couple of months, maybe, and stuff. Yeah, look, all. All, all players are going to have some sort of dip in form, but you can't you can't question his his ability and his quality. He's a, he's 
averages over 15 test cricket, he's the number one, well, he was the number one one-day batter in the world. To expect him to perform at that level every single time he walks out of bat is unreasonable and unfair. And all, all players are going to have some slump in form. I'm pretty confident that when it counts in the World Cup, Basham will be one of the guys who can really line and to, to put in a big performance. Um, given, given the fact that pitchers over the uh, Asian Cup are limited, Yeah, look, I think they're obviously going to be a little bit worn and a little bit tired, I suppose. Um, uh, spin will obviously be a big factor in it. Um, bowling straight lines will be a big factor in it. Um, excuse me. Um, and it's going to be a challenge. We know South Africans historically prefer playing on, I suppose, what you would call westernised wickets, English, Australian, um, South African wickets. So it's going to be a big challenge for us. But Look, we've, we've got a lot of players that have played under those conditions before. LB, AB, Faf's been in the IPL for a good few years. So um, we've, we've got the resources to counter that. And like I said, it just takes two or three guys to have an outstanding competition and we'll be there and thereabouts.